Good morning boys and girls and welcome to the Sunday School slot here in the rectory, another Sunday morning. I hope you're all well. Now boys and girls, we're going to finish looking today at the book that we've been studying over the last few weeks. Now I wonder, can you remember the name of the book? Can you remember what it is? Yes, it's the book of Philippians, Paul's letter to the Philippians. Now boys and girls, over this last number of weeks, we've had some memory verses to learn, haven't we? I wonder, can you remember any of them from Paul's letter? I hope you can. And if you can, that's really good. And if you can't, don't worry about it. Just try and remember them again. Read over them again and learn them again. But boys and girls, I've got one more memory verse for you today. And you know what? Out of the whole of the New Testament, this is actually my favourite verse. It's Philippians chapter 4 and verse 13 and it says this, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. All right boys and girls, words are going to be up here. I hope you could say it with me. Let's say it together. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Philippians chapter 4 verse 13. Let's try that again. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Philippians chapter 4 and verse 13. Now boys and girls, we're going to take these away and let's see if we can say it without them. Alright? I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Philippians chapter 4 verse 13. Now, boys and girls, see if we can remember that later on. But what does that verse actually mean? Well, it means that no matter what God asks us to do, he will give us the strength to do it. So does it mean that if you want to lift something really heavy, God's going to help you lift it? Well, no, that's not what it means. Unless God really wants you to lift it, of course. But that's not what it means. What it means is when God asks us to do something, he's going to help us to do it. He's going to give us everything that we need in order to do that. Now, boys and girls, I know you all know the song, My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. I know you know that song, boys and girls, and I know you know the actions. And we're going to sing it together because it reminds us of what God wants to do in our lives. He can do anything. Even we think we can't do it, God can help us to do it. So let's just remind ourselves of the actions of it, boys and girls. So it's, my God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. The rivers are his, the mountains are his, the stars are his handiwork too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. Hey boys and girls, we're going to sing it together, alright? The words are up here for you already. So we're going to sing it and I want you to sing it nice and loud and do all the actions. My God is so big. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. The rivers are His, the mountains are His, the stars are His handiwork too. So big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. Now we'll sing it again, boys and girls, alright? My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing. So mighty, there's nothing my God cannot 
boys and girls. I hope you were singing along with that song. And now, can you remember our memory verse? I wonder, do you remember what it was? Let's say it together. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. You remember that this week, boys and girls, that Jesus gives us everything that we need that he wants us to do. All right, we're going to pray together. So let's see your hands, put them together. Let's bow our heads and close our eyes and let us pray. Lord Jesus, we thank you that you give us the strength to do everything that you want us to do. We pray for your blessing, Lord, upon all the boys and girls and their mums and dads and everybody watching this this morning. We pray that you would be with them, that you'd keep them safe and draw them closer to you. For we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Now we'll say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. All right, boys and girls, you look after yourself. Stay safe and keep praying. Remember, keep washing those hands and we'll see you soon. Bye.